guys and welcome back to my channel. For those of you who are new here, my name is Shemaine and I do lipstick swatches. So today's video, we're gonna be doing Rihanna's Fenty Beauty Glossy Posse Holo Days Edition. So let's just get started. There are four shades in here and all the shades are also listed on the back of the package. I am just gonna start from left to right and that's how I will be swatching these. So we'll start with this first. Um, so we'll start with this first shade here, which is called Ruby Milk. So lastly, but not leastly, I have Baby Brute, which is more like a milky kind of nude. Very milky. And then I have the swatch here as well. So this is what we have for Baby Brute. I just want to give you guys some feedback on how this lip gloss wears throughout the day. So this is what I'm gonna be wearing and then, um, like usual, I will check back with you guys in like a few hours. So right now it's 11.25 a.m. You can see I am on the phone. I've literally been on the phone with customer service for like half hour. I started filming this video and I'm done filming and I'm still on the line waiting so that's why I actually have my um, ear pods in <laughs> if you haven't noticed but the struggle is real it's so hard to get on the phone with this company I don't want to call any names but yeah um, I've been trying to multitask here you know you know how it can get so yeah um, it's 11.25 a.m. and then I will be back later to give you guys some feedback on how uh, this lipstick performed. So, I'll catch you later. Hey guys, so I am back with the final review of the Fenty Beauty Glossy Posse Holo Days Lip Glosses. So the last one I had on is Baby Brute, which is this milky nude shade. I have it swatched here in the back of my hand if you don't remember what it looked like. But I put this on around 11.30. Right now it is 2.19 p.m. I wanted to wear it for a little longer, but I noticed that, hey, it's pretty much disappeared. So it really doesn't make sense for me to continue to see what's going to happen because this is it. There's nothing else that can happen here. <laughs> and um, it was already a nude shade to start with and that's like part of the problem when we're reviewing nude lip glosses or lipsticks is that it's going to be hard to see if I am still wearing the product or if the product has completely disappeared from my lips. So what I tend to typically do is get a makeup wipe and remove the product to see if there is anything left. So it has pretty much disappeared. Uh, there is really nothing there that came off. It's just a light dusting of it, but nothing too pronounced for you to see. So as you can see, these really don't last very long. And like I said, that's typical of lip glosses. 
However, what we want to focus on is how my lips feel, the quality of the product. So my lips still feel very much moisturized, very much hydrated, there is no doubt. It doesn't feel dry or cracky or anything of that matter. So that's how I know that it's also a quality lip gloss because my lips feel very comfortable. So when it comes to buying lip glosses, you have to think about do you just want it for the look or are you looking for functionality? So these lip glosses, don't get me wrong, these lip glosses are perfect for like a short-term glam look because you get the sparkles and the high shine of the lip gloss, but we all know that's not gonna last very long. Clearly, the product has disappeared from my lips, but what is left is moisturization, hydration. My lips still feel very comfortable. So you have to decide why you want this product. Do you want it for the short term look or appeal or um, do you want it for that and also just to have moisturized lips at the end of the day. So those are just some of the things that you would have to think about because at the end of the day, it's your coins. So you have to decide why you want to buy this product and if it's gonna be beneficial for you in the long term. But that was my review. If you guys like this video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Also, don't forget to subscribe so that you can continue to see more swatch videos like this. It does help my channel and it helps me to continue to provide more content like this for you guys. So I really do appreciate all the engagement that you guys give me. And um, that's all I got. So I will catch you guys in my next swatch video. Bye.